welcome back to my channel if y'all see my title today is the start of a new vlog so y'all my hair looks a fucking mess and let's talk about it first just adjust the elephant in the room so y'all i tried to do a braid out and this is what it looked this is how it turned out so i was gonna wear it all the way down but it looks fucking stupid so i was just trying to do something real quick and i just put these two ponytails at the top and yeah that's the more that's the story of my hair so y'all um no i'm not gonna say it because yeah we're going out of town this weekend for sure not this week this weekend yeah because we all get it yeah for Cheryl's birthday and I'm trying to see I was gonna do my hair like this weave but I did tell myself I was trying to avoid heat and stuff on my real hair for the month of April so I'm not gonna do it I could have did it with like a closure I'm gonna show y'all the hairstyle hold on why am I clicking archive go to save I'm gonna show y'all the style so yeah I was gonna do my hair like this for when we go because this is super fucking cute look at it that's cute as hell but i'm not gonna do that i'm gonna just wait and do that i'm gonna just instead have mari do me some braids look at these braids i'm already did mari just keep looking down in your phone mari did her braids look sorry no. mari did her braids and they just came out super cute so i'm gonna have mari do me some braids or i mean some butterfly locks i really want Oops. I want some like short butterfly locks or something like that or some long ones. I don't know what I want. I don't know what I want. I'm going to show you this TikTok I see. And I think I want these. Hold on. Because I think they're so cute. Hold on. Where they go? Like these are cute. Look. Those are cute. Or like it was another one that I seen. These are really freaking cute. Don't mind my nails. Like, these are super cute. So, I might do something like that. I'm going to beat Cheryl's ass if she don't stop doing that. I might do something like that or whatever. But right now, we're on the way to museum. Mu to museum. To the museum. We're going to the Gettys Museum. It's raining like crazy. Well, not right here. But, yeah, it was raining earlier. So, I don't know. Mario, are you excited to do my hair? If people ha ask you um, to do their hair, are you going to do it? I don't know. So, like, if somebody say, oh, Mari, can Amari do my hair? Are you going to do it? Anyway, so, yeah, I'm super excited to get my hair done. So, that's cool. So, that mean, because um, if I would have put a glue in my hair anyway, I would have had to take it out because I'm going to get my hair done again on the 18th. No, the 16th. So, yeah. This would be a style that lasts for a cool minute. Because if I would have did that weave, my real leave out, I would've, it would probably got dirty out of it. Yeah, this just must make more sense for me. Y'all, I'm so happy because in my last vlog comments, when I had mentioned like the health scare with so many people that was like sharing very useful information. And I'm super happy about that. Um, a heads up, I do go back to the neurologist on the 10th. Um, somebody had DM me and told me to ask for an MRI. So I'm most definitely I'm going to ask for that. Um, yup. Also, um, what I was saying too, like when you're pre-diabetic, make sure you're taking walks. Try to take so, like a walk after every meal is good if you can. But if not, I seen somebody said her dad in the comments was saying her dad walks a mile. Um, he was walking a mile every five days or every day. And that helps. So yeah, make sure you're walking. And that helps your blood. Just, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not, I don't know the best terms. But yeah, but anyway, we about to go to where we going. And I'll talk to y'all when we get there. Mari say what's up. Don't trip. You guys, so we're at the museum. Mari, stop. At the museum. Do you not know I could hear you making that noise? We all could hear you making that noise. She sounds like a certain someone I know. Cheryl? Yeah. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends, but you know that I do not depend. I'm being wrong. You're supposed to put your arm around me and point to the camera and sing. <laughs> you are my friend. You are my fire. Don't make me sweet but strong desire. I just want to satisfy you. But you're my heart. I can't deny ya. Don't you hear me talking, baby? Love me now. Oh, my dear. Go, Cheryl. Sure, I'll sing the fucking song. I don't know the lyrics to some parts. 
I need that quarter of milk. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm not going shit. Cheryl, you gonna be the husband? Job when no one else was there. Helping you get on your feet. Um, Y'all, look at me with my little ponytail. I slick my hair so much. I do not know how to damn slick my hair. I'm trying to find the best lighting, but I can't find it. Because the lighting is dark here. Outside. But anyway, um, I'm with Jay Risha. And um, we at an Easter event. She charging her phone up right now. I just got here. Y'all, I'm so mad because I've been parking in the garage. But last night I was like, oh, I'm gonna just, I don't feel like pulling in the garage. Y'all, literally. Literally. Look at this shit. The birds had a field day. They was like, oh, you back? And they just went and shit it all over my car. They just shit it all over my car. And I'm sad about it. But, um. Huh? It's not Oh, I think Buddha's leaving. Um, yeah, so. I'm sad because. You gonna clean it off? No, why would I clean off your bird poop? Yeah, but y'all, oh, no. y'all seen how my hair was yesterday? I, well, I slept with it like that. Last night, I just threw it in a high bun, went to sleep. That shit was dry and crazy. That's why I'm even surprised I was able to slick my hair. I don't hey, know how to do slick ponytail. Girl, yeah, because I was going to most definitely show your information. <laughs> Y'all. Um, no. You can take one. Girl, just, I ain't ate since breakfast. I don't want no shot. It was raining. Oh, I didn't have no breakfast. It's raining. I didn't have breakfast. It's raining. Do you want to stay out here in the rain? No, but I just need a little baby shot. I did not know it was raining. I didn't have breakfast this morning. We're about to go in. I'm probably not going to vlog much, but I just wanted to talk to y'all for a little bit. Happy Easter. I love y'all so much. <sighs> you read? Huh? You read? Oh, can you see my books? Mm -hmm. I told you I keep books in my car. That's smart. Are you gonna say happy Easter to my vlog? Hey y'all, happy Easter. What's up y'all? I am back home. As y'all can see, I'm in my bed. Um, if y'all can see, I have not replaced that picture up there, there yet. I have not put that picture back up. It's literally off to the side. And I have another picture right here that I gotta put up. But I'm gonna do that all this week before this week is over, though. Before I leave or whatever. But, um, yeah, I'm in my bed. Today was fun. Today was Easter. As y'all can see it earlier, we was out with the kids. And afterwards, um, I ended up going to my mom's house. Cheryl was sick. My mom was kind of sick. She still cooked and stuff, though. Um... We took my grandma and my uncle some food. What happened? Yeah, and then I just chilled out over there for a little while. Then I came home because I ain't going to lie. I was a little tired. It's 1031 and I'm already in bed. No, this is not my outside shirt. Well, I did have a shirt on, but I had it on with a jacket. So I feel like it's cool. Mm. But anyway, so yeah, I'm in bed right now. Um, I need to actually get up so I could take this stuff off of my face. And all that. Y'all, look how my ponytail. I cannot get over my ponytail. I need to take this out, loosen it up, though. My hair is really growing back, y'all. I can't wait till it's, like, really, really grown. Because let me sit up. Because, y'all, not me over here looking like I got a triple double neck. But anyway, I can't wait till it's, like, fully, fully grown. Because, yeah, then it would be cool. Oh, yeah, I had tried to do a braid out. I don't know if I had mentioned that, y'all. But please tell me when y'all do, if you do braid outs, let me know what products to use, what to use. Because when I try to do a braid out nothing didn't happen like it was literally nothing going on it it didn't even shrink up it was not it just it pissed me off bad so i was irritated because i already thought i was gonna have a super cute braid out look with my hair just like puffy and y'all see how it was yesterday at the museum it was not giving at all but um yeah tomorrow i plan on going downtown la i plan on going to santi alley i've been needing to go there for a cool minute but it just be like uh y'all it'll be a drag but i'm like i'm gonna just go early my day is gonna be like i'm gonna get up early i'm gonna make me some breakfast i'm gonna work out because i said i'm gonna do i'm gonna set i'm gonna work out so i'm gonna work out um i'm gonna package these orders then i'm gonna just head to the alley look for what i'm looking for because i'm going on a not this trip that i'm going on for sure birthday because I could already find all right i'm gonna just wear what i already have it's not that deep but my next trip that i'm going on later this month 
I'm going somewhere I've never been before. And it just gives like, yeah. And it's going to be cold. So I got to find some stuff. So that's why I'm like, I need to go get some stuff because that's going to come real quick. So, yeah. So I'm going to go to the alley and after that, I'm going to spend time with my grandma. Then I'm going to come home. So I'm real quick. But, um... Yes, for now, I'm just chilling a bit. Probably about to watch something. I got YouTube on, but it's just literally... I literally just put on random ass YouTube. Like, literally random people. I be finding the most, like, small YouTubers. Like, I love watching small YouTubers. Big YouTubers, too. I don't have nothing against that. I like watching YouTube, period. But, like, I'll find some good vlogs when i just put my tv on and just scroll and just click on like oh this look interesting and just watch it like i don't know i'll be finding a lot of people i'll go subscribe then i'll be binge watching i start commenting because i'll be like oh i like this one thing about it like i like story times too don't get me wrong i love watching story times but i love a good vlog like a good vlog will have me sunk in because i'll be like oh like it just i don't know i just love vlogs it's really something about them. but anyway like i was saying i'm in the house with it it's hot as hell my eyes been doing a little update on my eyes they've been okay it seemed like they switched now now this one is starting to hurt and not the left one let me see if it's still blurry though uh, let me see only how i could tell if it's blurry is if i compare it let me see it's these books on my dresser right here and i'm gonna check like that all right let's see Mm, and it's, it's getting better it's not as blurry as it was before oh that's still a little blurry though yeah when i was just looking at the tv because i'm like on this one it's clear as day then when i go to this side it's like a little blurry but it's getting better i feel like it's getting a little better i've been doing my eye drops i've been wearing my glasses but this eye been hurting though this one's not blurry but my right one been hurting but i'm just like ugh. i go to the neurologist on the 10th so next week so hopefully they could tell me if it's something going on, if it's something wrong. So we get this figured out because I don't have time for it. I hate it. And I know it's probably really my electronics because that's when it bothers me the most. So I really need to just stay on to wear my glasses like when I'm looking at my electronics. Because all these lights and feel, like all this shit is fucking with me. And I don't like that. I need my eyes working for when I have my grand, when I have my kids. And then my grandkids be like, Grandma, can you take us to do a run out? I could see what's going on. You know, like I need my eyes. But anyway, Easter was good, though. My mom didn't make no duck, so I was sad about that. But everything she made was still good as hell. She made some lamb. It was super good. Um, What else was I about to say? What's something else I was about to say? Y'all, tell me why. This is just a little before I go. Before I go. Y'all, I really be stressing myself out about dumb stuff. Because when I was talking, my mom was asking me, like, are you stressed out about anything? Is it, like, something causing you stress that can mess with you? Because he was saying that stress could play a factor, you know, like, in vision blurriness since they saying they ain't seen none this second time i went to an eye doctor but i'm gonna keep going because like y'all told me don't let when one doctor won't say the next will so i don't care i'm gonna keep paying that copay and going because like y'all said if, it, if i feel uncomfortable about it keep going until you figure it out so anyway my mom was asking me if i'm stressed about something i'm like no like not that i know of at this moment but i'm like it do be little stuff that stresses me out it'd be little stupid shit that stress me out y'all and i was literally just telling my boyfriend this i'm like i'd be stressed out over stupid shit like I'm over here stressed thinking like, so if me and him get married, what state would it be in? Y'all, I swear I was so stressed. And I was telling him this and he's like, and only reason why is because we talk about like marriage and stuff like that, of course. But only so he's like, we get married in whatever state you want to get married in. But I'm like, okay, but like, but your family is in this state. Mine is over here. Your family is over here. Mine is over here. So like, where will we get married at? And then it's like this big thing. And I'm just like, I'm just stressed out. Mind y'all, I'm not even engaged. I'm not even <laughs> that's what i'm talking about when i say i stress myself out about stupid shit why am i stressed about something like this and i'm not even engaged like girl be have the ring first before you be just stretched i'm like what does that look like someone's on my face but so i had a ring first before you be stressing out about where the fuck you gonna get married at because i swear i was stressed and i'm like so where do you think and he's like wherever you want to go like you know it's up to you like i don't mind i'm like oh that is me you stressing me out. Then he said a boat. I said, I'm not getting married on a boat. The fuck? This look like the love boat cruise ship? No. I'm like, I'm not getting married on a boat. If I'm getting married on a boat, I might as well get married with an Elvis Presley impress impersonator. Like, the fuck? I'm just kidding. No, I wouldn't mind getting married on a boat, but I just get, I get queasy. So I know like... I've seen some cute, I've seen a cute boat wedding before, but I just got to have my vision wedding in my head. So it's like, I just tell you, you pay for it and we go from there. But 
Yeah, boat wedding, I couldn't because I feel like I'll probably throw up when I'm saying my vows. Y'all see, look, now I'm stressed all over again. Let me stop. All right, I'm going to just watch something and go to sleep. Take this ponytail out because it's kind of squeezing the back of my head. All right, so I'll see y'all tomorrow. I'm going to vlog as best I can because in the alley, it'd be a lot going on. If you went to the Santee Alley before, it'd be a lot going on. People trying to sell you a dog. People trying to sell you some Gucci and Louis Prada. Gucci, Louis Prada. People would be trying to sell you... um everything thing like it just be a lot going on then it'd be like people you gotta watch out for it's just too much so yeah i'm gonna try to vlog if i vlog it for sure be on my my phone and not my camera i'm not pulling i'm not about to be y'all can't see me but i'm not about to walk around my camera like hey you guys with my whole light up and all that mm, i ain't doing all that it would most definitely be my phone but yeah um i'll see y'all later i'm gonna talk to y'all later i feel like i'm just rambling right now for no apparent reason and i don't like that so bye let me tell y'all something that irritated me. I know y'all probably like, girl, everything is irritating you. So, y'all, I hit this girl up because Cheryl's birthday is tomorrow, April 2nd. So, I hit this girl up. She said, her thing says five to seven days in advance, right? I hit her up eight days in advance because I see she hasn't been posting on Instagram like that. So, I'm like, let me hit her up um, now. So, I hit her up. I don't know if I had mentioned it in my last vlog or whatever like that. Where the fuck, bro? I'm about to get here okay anyway i hit her up or whatever and she ended up responding maybe like later that same day she responded like late at night like super late and she was just like oh okay do you yeah like i could do it for you or whatever i told her the date i told her everything i like it's like hey i want it for this date this Da, 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 this design she was like oh do you have a picture of how you want it so i sent her what i wanted it was something that she made on her page so it's not like i sent her some way out shit like that's why i'm contacting you because i seen some on your page that i like so i messaged the girl whatever i followed her on instagram too because i understand some people probably be like bitch i ain't doing no service but you don't even follow me so i followed her and everything right so she ended up hitting me back yeah that later that night she was like oh yeah do you have a picture example so i sent it to her the one that she did and i told her the color oh that's why i was trying to have me go around i can't go through the parking lots so anyway i sent her the color i sent her the thing i sent her the colors that i wanted all that i was and i'm it's crazy because i think i mentioned it in my last vlog and i was gonna post it but something told me i was gonna show y'all her page and show y'all her work but something told me simone do not do it because if this girl plays if this girl flakes and do some weird shit you're gonna be mad that you promoted this girl's business so some told me not to fucking do it and i'm happy i didn't so um she never i'm wondering because i seen her her thing and said you got to pay half the deposit and then the rest is due the day before um yeah like you got to pay half up front and then the rest is due the day before before you pick it up and i'm like okay whatever i was okay with that so she kept asking me so then she started replying later and later asking me the same questions like okay so you need it for april 2nd i'm like yeah mind you when she has said that again because she's replying back slow and just asking me the same thing over and over again bro people do stupid shit for real she asked me the same thing over and over again so i'm like yeah y'all why after saturday she has not responded today is monday she stopped responding my thing is if you know you're having a conversation with somebody bro where the fuck is this place at i'm about to get irritated if you know you're having a conversation with somebody like when do you check your dms she just stopped fucking responding my thing is but your last thing you said to me was like okay you need for april 2nd you could have at least said hey i can't do it it's annoying because it's like i had somebody else in mind but i don't want to be that person that sits up and oh no last time she responded was friday my bad and she put yeah no worries and you said for the april 2nd right and i said yes for april 2nd and she never replied it's annoying because it's like i had somebody else in mind i'm like just in case she couldn't do it but i'm like i don't want to be contacting two people and then people be like oh like and then if she says she could do it and I tell the person, oh, never mind, you know. So I was so irritated because I'm just like, I could have went through somebody else. Now it's the day before her birthday. Who the fuck finna do um, something for me? Like, it was super cute. It was chocolate covered strawberries and flowers. Like, it was a bouquet. And it said happy birthday on it and it had, like, butterflies. It was super cute. <sighs> it's just annoying because it's like you could have said you couldn't do it. You literally ain't messaged me back since Friday. You could have just said no like girl you're fucking weird i swear people run a business so fucking weird that shit pisses me the fuck off like i ain't even gonna lie that shit irritates me bad how people run a business because it's like what what the fuck is wrong with you 
If you didn't, if you looked at my page and said, hey, nah, I'm cool. I don't do shit. Like, you could have just said that. Like, oh, I'm booked or I can't do it. But instead, you just didn't say nothing. You just waste my time. And I was still thinking, like, let me just give it the benefit of the doubt. What if she hit me up today and be like, oh, I could do it or whatever. But I'm like, let me stop trying to hold on to hope. So I'm like, where we're going, I'm just about to look on TikTok and see um, if somebody could do it. Where are we going for her birthday? Like this weekend. If somebody out there do something similar or something cute. Or I might just try to find some last minute place and like um some last minute place and just do something like that. Like because I don't know. That's just irritating. That just annoyed me. Like people really run a business so fucking weird, bro. Weird. It's a lot of weirdos. Oh, I should have turned in right there. I could turn right here. All right, bye, y'all. Cause you can never do my vibe But there we no sacrifices Everything was taken You have to make it Vibe killer what's up y'all i'm back at home y'all it's still april 1st y'all tell me why oh i thought i already told y'all about ups and stuff like that all right i'm gonna get y'all a mini haul of the stuff i got so first let's do the alley so hold on look at my bag i had to put it in like this because after i had left downtown i had went to um the grocery store and i was just trying to carry all this stuff upstairs and it was stressing me out y'all so i was supposed to get stuff for my vacation and i literally didn't get nothing for this vacation but i got stuff uh like other time because i'm like i gotta go other places one day <laughs> i'm just kidding but no for real that's one thing about going to the alley it's like i get distracted and forget why i'm there and get some way out other stuff but let me show y'all i went to my jumpsuit store it says jumpsuit store there i love these jumpsuits and i got the long sleeve one it's like a cream color it's a long sleeve type in the front i don't know if i put like a little what's called and like this i love these because they fit my body so good and they don't be like all soggy in the crotch area like i hate that and then i went to this other store called glam by ks and i got a few things from here actually because oh one of the things i am going to use from well the accessories too but look this jacket made me think about it so i got this jacket this is so cute look at this jacket the back is so cute. And I was like, damn, I wish they had something in the front. But this lady that was in the store shopping too, she was like, girl, just buy some patches online and put them on there. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to have my sister put them on there. I'm going to get some patches and have her put them on the front. Because I feel like that's super cute. But I just really wish it was something in the front. But I might. Like, Let me just get it. So I got that. And then I got this outfit. This was so cute on the mannequin. So it's this skirt. And then the top is let me show you let me show y'all wait how does it go oh the top and then it got the sleeves you tie it up in the front and then i got this outfit because i was like this is giving vacation vibes and i'm going on a vacation like a tropical vacation this year most definitely so is this skirt and oops almost fell almost had you out there in this top which I should have got the top in a medium because your girl back is big. Oh, it stretches. Okay. Because y'all got a big bag. But by the time I plan on going on these vacations, I do plan on losing weight because, well, not losing weight because I'm trying to gain and lose. So I'm trying to, I'm going to lose this back and I'm going to gain in this ass and these thighs. So yeah, I'll be all right. And then they had these accessories. So I got these earrings because these were so cute. Look, hold on. Let me move my eyes so y'all can see them. Look at these. These is cute. Tell me these not cute. So I got those. And yeah, that's what I got from there. Let me put my stuff back in here. I'm cooking and it smells so good, y'all. I'm making some salmon. And I know I always be like, I'm going to cook with y'all, but I really be forgetting. I'm not even going to lie. Like when I just seasoned it up and just put it in the oven, I literally forgot. Um, and then I went to Forever 21, y'all. Forever 21 was having 40% off the entire store. Let me back y'all up. 
sock out some space. Okay, those are forty percent off the entire store. Y'all see them right there? I need to get rid of my birthday balloons because why do I still have them? But yeah, let me show y'all because I spent so much. Well, I didn't spend so much. I saved so much, y'all. I saved because it showed like the discount how much you saved. I saved like one fifty, y'all. I got these shorts. Hopefully, I can fit them. I gotta try them on. I got these shorts. They was like some cute little little short shorts i thought these were so cute i'm mad because the color is not showing up but they like a, a off-white they kind of like a yellowish color i don't know but i like these like an eggshell eggshell white like the yellowish white i got those shorts i'm gonna do a haul for them since i got so much stuff i'm like oh i'm gonna do me a forever 21 haul that'll be cute so then i got this skirt i felt like this skirt was so cute i love me a jean skirt i got it in the medium and i got this skirt another cute skirt and then i got um these panties was cute so i just got these panties N look when i realized that everything was 40 percent off that's my problem i was just like oh i might as well just grab this they're 40 percent off y'all <laughs> i was like oh, i'm gonna get these panties so i got these panties y'all and um i got this this dress was so cute it's a denim dress. What size I get? A small, right? Okay, yeah. But I gotta try it on. Hopefully, it looks right. Y'all, it's super cute. Denim. Got that. Um, these body suits is so soft. But I'm gonna wash them first because I don't know if people try them on. But yeah, there's a white one. And it's the V-cut. Super cute. And they so soft. When I tell you they so soft, when I realized it's, I had only had the white one. When I realized it was 40% off, I went and got this brown one. Because I was like, oh, yeah. The brown. This I don't know why it's showing so light right here, but it's really a chocolate brown. But on here, it's showing, like, really light. Probably because of the light. Let me see if I cut it off. No, it just don't make a difference. Okay. So then, I got me another brown bodysuit. This one was cute. So I got this. And... Uh, then this is when i was leaving i was i was walking to go back because i had went and grabbed that bodysuit and i had seen this i had no i actually had seen this because and i was like wait i seen this skirt y'all it's not showing the color hold on maybe if i change the the lighting on here is it gonna show it no when i do my haul it'll probably show it better because then i'll be like at better lighting but it's a mint green it's so cute this skirt it's a mint green skirt. I'm mad because I really wanted to get a small, but they didn't have a small. They had this medium, but I think this might fit though, actually. But y'all, and I had seen that skirt and I'm like, wait, I seen a jacket like that earlier. So y'all went and got the jacket. It's a whole two piece set. Look at this. This a mint green. I got an extra small on the jacket because it kind of looked big. So, and I wanted to fit like, oh yeah, and I'm putting it over a jacket and it's, it's yeah. But I really wish y'all could see it. It's really like a, a mint color no no show it's cool when i do my haul like i said y'all see so then um i was walking to the line and i seen these green glasses i thought these was cute i'll be buying shades and don't even be wearing them i bought some boob tape boob lifting tape because i said it's 40 percent off why not oh wait see i knew i wasn't tripping y'all well they just gonna have to if i can't fit they just have to take that because I was like, I don't think my receipt in here. And he was like, yeah, it's at the way bottom of the bag. And it's not in my bag, but it's fine because y'all can run them up the cameras. I thought this body belt was super cute. So I got it. And, but hopefully I ain't got to take nothing back. And then this belt was so cute too. It's a denim belt. Oops. It like, look. It's a denim studded belt. And it has like the big buckle. I know Cheryl would like this. She liked those like this, but I was like, oh, this is cute. So I got that. I knew I was not tripping. That boy did not put my receipt. He did not put my receipt in here. I better be able to fit everything. But again, you already know if you don't have your receipt, they just gonna give you store credit. But it's not like I want the money back anyway. I really would just want to exchange for my size. But um, yeah, that's all I got. So yeah, I can't wait to do my haul though. I'm gonna record it when Amari do my hair. Cause I'm gonna have Amari braid my hair, y'all. I'm gonna get, um, I was gonna get some butterfly locks. Hold on, let me put this stuff back in first. Okay. So I was gonna get some butterfly locks, but then she was like, oh, well, if you, like if she do them for me, she was gonna do them for my little sister. She was like, if I do them, just make sure you have me help you take them out. So I'm like, why? She was like, cause um, I cut, like I got patches in my head from when I was trying to cut them out. 
So I'm like, I'm trying to get this style because I didn't want to do the weave because I wanted to like, I don't want to put no heat on my hair all of April. So I was like, dang, I don't know if I want them anymore. So I'm like, dang, never mind. And then I was still going to get them because she's like, no, it's cool. I could just help you take them out. Why I go on TikTok, first TikTok that pop up was, this is my, that was my first and last time getting butterfly locks. I got patches all over my head. And I said, oh, this is a sign. I ain't getting them. This is my sign. So instead, I'm going to get some braids. I think I showed y'all in this vlog. I don't know if I showed y'all or not. So I'm going to get some braids, but I want them short because I was going to get my butterfly locks short too. And I'm going to get them like super boho. So y'all, hold on. Let me see. I'm trying to find a picture. When I was looking for a picture, I've seen this picture when I was in downtown. Y'all look at these damn BBL um, freaking mannequins. It was advertising the waist shapers, but I'm like, that's so funny. But anyway, they could at least put a wig on my girl. But anyway, um, dang, where's these braids at? At first I was looking at something like this, but she was like, she don't know how to do um, French braids. So I was like, all right, dang. So I'm gonna get, let me see, hold on. Let me see. Um, where is the person not letting me go to? Let me cut this move down. I'm gonna get something like this. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I'm gonna get some braids. I'm um, short and curly. And I already got some curly hair I ordered, or ordered off of Amazon. But I was so happy for them short, them short locks, man. But I'm scared because I was looking at this like, oh y'all can't see it. Focus. I don't know why it's doing that. Maybe if I cut the lights off. But yeah, I was looking at short like boho locks, and I thought they were so cute. But I'm gonna just get my braids. I'm gonna get the braids. I think it would be cute. Like this is cute. Look. Oh yeah, let me show y'all something, y'all. I got a sample made of a Brashari bag that I'm about to drop. I'm gonna drop it in some nudes colors because I'm gonna do a whole little thing called Send Me Nudes. I wanna do a, a collection called Send Me Nudes. And I'm excited. I just posted it on my story. Let me see. Let's see what the um, results in. People are saying, yes, they like it. Only one person said no. And it's like, girl, fuck you. I'm just <laughs> No, bro, if you don't like it, you don't like it, but... Okay, but anyway, let me go ahead and show y'all the bag. Let me go grab it. Oops. Okay, this is the purse. How y'all feel about it? How y'all feel? Let me get my eyes out. This is so cute. I love it. I'm going to do it in nudes. This is like a nude color, but it's showing up. Well, it's not showing up white on here. It's showing up like real light, but it's like a beige color. And I love the... I just love it. I love it. And then this is the back, y'all. I got a little compartment in the back. And then when you open it up, hold on, open it up. It got the compartment in here. It got, boom, a little zipper right there. And then the zipper back here. And y'all already know in the inside, it got the logo. Dang, can I show y'all on the inside? Hold on. Oh, I could just lift it up. In the inside, I got the logo for Shari. And then it has it right here too super cute but i really love this i'm loving this um this bag this sample and i like the size too because at first when i had got like a crossbody made it was smaller than this let me actually go get it to show y'all so yeah this other crossbody i got made which is super cute i like this style too however i was just like it's kind of small but this one don't have like the compartment in the back oh it do never mind i lied so yeah but this is the size difference y'all see but I'm really loving this one. I love the size. I like how big it is. Like if I wanted to put my camera in here, I could put my camera in here. It's big, but it's not too big, but it's cute. It still gives like evening back. This mini one is cute too. I'll probably go with some mini ones, but probably, I don't know, probably the same style. What y'all think? Let me see. Yeah, not this like, what y'all think? And then I'm like in love with the straps on this one. Like I had to make sure like do the straps like this because this one is how the straps is on this one, which is fine. But I like these these straps better. So y'all tell me, tell me what y'all think. Tell me. But I think I might do both. But y'all, but for now, when I do my semi nudes, it's gonna be this one. I'm gonna do this like a nude color, and I'm gonna do it in a brown color. And yeah, but I'm super excited. Just because of where Prashari is going and everything like that. I do want to plan another event, y'all. So stay tuned for that. 
I want to plan something for June for my one year. I actually need to get on if I'm going to do it because it's already April. April, May, June. That's two months away. So I'm like, uh, I don't know. I'm just like, I really don't know what to do. But yeah, I don't know if I should do like, like, oh, I think I had already mentioned it, like another brunch or something like that. I'm about to start looking at venues and stuff like that and then go from there and yeah, and then figure it out. But um, yeah, let me know if y'all would be interested in if y'all would pull up. Like, is y'all gonna come if I, if I was to do that or what? But yeah, that's it. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow for Cheryl's birthday and then I'm probably in the vlog off there. I actually need to give me some braiding hair and stuff. I can't wait for Amari to do my hair. Let me, um... Let me text her. She's doing my auntie hair right now. And yeah, I don't know, but I can't wait for her to do my hair. Can't wait for it to hop on the camera, but that might be in another vlog. Cause I might end this vlog here and then just start pre-recording all my other stuff that I need to do. Like my, um, my, this haul, I want to do that, but I got to wait till I get my braids on Wednesday. I'm mad that your birthday is tomorrow because I would have had her do my hair tomorrow, but it's all, it's all good. But yeah. Um, yeah, that's it. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow for Cheryl's birthday. I'm still mad about that fucking girl doing that stupid shit. That shit pissed me off like bad because that bouquet would have been super cute for her. So I'm still mad about that, but it's fine. I'll figure out. I unfollowed her and everything because girl, you're weird. You know you seen my damn message, fucking weirdo. But anyway, that's it. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Sorry, bye. This day that God has given me, I'm not gonna waste this joy deep down inside me. I'm not gon' shake, been stressed for so long So stuck in my own way, so I enjoy this moment It's the day that the Lord has made Inside. Too afraid to open up, so I'd rather hide Man, I'm just so grateful that I made it this far Almost thought I had to call my mama in a cup cup Betty's every